once again welcome you guys this is Vijay from Electronic Thurman and today we are going to see a simple circuit called automatic washroom light or automatic room light whatever you say you don't need any controllers for this circuit because I have used only one transistor for operating which is a normal NPN transistor BC547 and it is a purely continuation from my previous tutorial known as rectifier which is the first video in my electronic thumbnail page so this is the rectifier part I, have, I will be connecting this 230 volt mains to this terminal and it will be stepped down it will be connected here this transformer will be stepped down this 230 volt to 12 volt and this 12 volt will be rectified and I have used 7805 here but in my previous tutorial I have uh, used LM317 for uh, voltage regulation in various voltages levels but uh, here I need only 5 volts so I have used 7805 so after this this capacitors are used by uh, explanation in a previous rectifier tutorial so please watch that too and this is a normal BC547 transistor which is an NPN transistor and this is a relay driver relay normal 5 volt relay uh, this this is a PR sensor which is known as passive infrared sensor this passive infrared sensor is mostly used for detecting the human motion it it will not detect the human motion it will be detecting the IR radiations that is reflecting from the motion of the body so it is known as passive infrared sensor it has two three terminals 5 volt ground and output it's a digital sensor so once it detects the signal it will be giving one or higher the input output uh, otherwise it will be giving no this is a terminal where I have connected the load I will explain you the operation of relay in this circuit ok now guys I am going to explain the operation of a simple relay uh, this part is the this part is the relay coil uh, this one part of the coil is connected to the 5 volt supply and other part is connected to the ground it is a switch manual operator switch please consider it as a sensor which I have connected in the circuit uh, as a passive infrared sensor itself now, now it is the normally open part and this is the normally closed part and once I press this switch the coil gets energized and the normally closed part is relieved and it connects to the normally open part so the circuit gets closed and my load gets acting this is the simple operation of the relay uh, this is the basic principle behind this project it's a simple project I will show you the circuit diagram for your better understanding Wow. Wow. 